Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. I hope you are well. In this video we'll talk about spiders web. Spiders build their webs to catch prey. But every time they catch prey the web gets damaged or destroyed and the spider needs to rebuild it again. It's the only creature whose home gets destroyed every time it catches food. The web can be damaged by wind alone. In the Quran, the parable of those who take protectors other than Allah is that of the spider who builds to itself a house. But truly, the weakest of houses is the spider's house, if they but knew. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives us example in the Holy Quran for those who take protectors or allies other than Allah is that of the spider who builds to itself a house. The example of such individuals is that of the spider that builds to itself a house. Then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentions something interesting. The most unreliable house is the house of the spider, if they but knew. Now, why cobweb is the most unreliable house in the world? Because cobweb is not a house of safety, it is not a house of comfort. First and foremost, it is the flimsy in nature and most importantly, it is a deadly trap. The spider views it not to seek protection in it but rather to trap other insects. So the spider's house is a deadly trap. It is so deadly that it is not even safe for its inhabitants. Subhanallah. Today, science proves that a cobweb is not even safe for the spider. Allahu Akbar. When the male and female spiders mate, which is quite normal, what happened is, the male spider right after sexual intercourse is supposed to flee for its life. If it gets caught in the cobweb, the female spider eats up the male spider. Allahu Akbar. The male spider has to run out of its own house before the female spider cats up and eat it up alive. This is why Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, The most unreliable of house is the house of the spider, if they but knew. Besides giving the physical description of the spider's web as being very flimsy, delicate and weak, the Quran also stresses on the flimsiness of the relationship in the spider's house, where the female spider many a times kill its mate, the male spider. Science proves it after so much of research with the help of modern microscopes and cameras. How could a man who lived 1400 years ago have known who has the weakest home? So that's it for today brothers and sisters. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and share this video to your friends and family. Until next time, Assalamu Alaikum.